This is yet another strategic gathering of the UPP leadership. And this time, it is for its next meeting where eight key decisions were taken. One of these is the unanimous decision not to fill a candidate in next year's presidential elections. UPP shall not sponsor a presidential candidate for the 2019 presidential election. The party shall use the period between now and 2023 year election to consolidate its nationwide political structures and concentrate energy and resources in active participation in other elective contests, namely governorship, Senatorial House of Representatives and State Assembly elections in Nigeria. UDP shall continue to explore the possibility of a constructive engagement with a political party or parties through alliance for electoral leverage and enhance advantage in the democratic context. Make has mandated the National Working Committee to review the reports of the various committees that have been attending, that have attended meetings on alliance through coalition with other political parties and take appropriate decision in the best interest of the party. The UPP also outlined the best way to handle the ongoing defection trend in the polity. To consolidate is nationwide political structure and concentrate energy and resources in active participation in other elective contests and the uh, national other contests. This is the core reason we are not going to spread ourselves in. And when it was time for the question and answer sessions, UPP's governorship aspirant in Imo State, Tony Wulu, was the focus of attention. Uh, Honorable sir, have you come to you people to stay or just looking for a political uh, platform, platform where you will achieve their ambition and maybe, maybe, may God forbid, then maybe it doesn't work out, you go back to where you are coming from. I am, I am very comfortably spread here. Very comfortably spread here. I am not really. Is currently the third force in emo politics and is keen on using its advantage to send a clear message on its readiness for mainstream Nigerian politics.